Uh, Maxi, we'll start with uh, Tuesday night. Uh, disappointing, I guess. But spending more. Yeah, definitely. Uh, disappointing result. I think um, yeah, pro- probably a game of two halves, maybe. Uh, but yeah, you can't dwell on it too much, though, can you? We have got um, the games coming thick and fast, so Saturday we need to move on quickly and prepare for that. So that's what we'll do. I suppose frustratingly got back into the game at 2-2 looked like we'd be the team to win it and obviously a referee in positional error has kind of cost us hasn't it yeah definitely um, but in saying that you have to you have to cut out little errors here and there and that led to us being in that position in the first place so yeah I think it's a small bump on the, on the long road to success yeah that game and, and the Southport game a few individual errors amongst lads I suppose the positive in that is we're not getting carved open and it's just individual sure. errors yeah it? absolutely so if, if, uh, if the lads put them out then we should be a lot more resolute as we have been um, for the, the greater part of the season so yeah how has it felt out there recently? Um, it's been a mixture of emotions um, like every football game but some parts very very good and some parts not uh, so we can we, we all know that as a as a team as a squad, but it was great to get in it about us all, um, and we're all very keen to um, to win every game and to to be successful. So I think it's important that we all stick together and um, stay on that path. I think the last couple of weeks of results in the whole division have shown just how strange this division is. We beat Farsley six 0 here. They go and beat Kingsland. It is really bizarre, isn't it? Yeah, it is bizarre. It is bizarre, but we just have to make sure that we do our job. We do what we need to do on Tuesday nights and Saturday afternoons because ultimately that's all we can control. Uh, whether we're playing against our own performances, our own results, so that is what we'll be doing. Buxton this weekend, they were a tough team last year, weren't they? And, and they're full time this year, so expecting another tough game. Absolutely, there's no easy games. Um, They'll come here and try to impose themselves and up their game as everyone does, um, so it's another test another challenge to us that we're going to have to stand up to um, but we're all confident that we we will do so Yeah, it's, it's hard isn't it we, we keep saying it but teams really do just have that 10% on them we've got to be on it every single week it is like a cup final every week to the opposition absolutely yeah absolutely yeah but that even with the crowd and everything I think the pressure is a privilege you want to be you want to be at the, the, the top end you want teams to be coming out to beat you so yeah, it is pressure, but like I said, it's a privilege and it's something that you've got to tr- you've got to thrive in um, to to be at this at this football club. So yeah, and obviously for you back in the team, uh, Will got injured quite early on last week. I suppose for you, you just want to nail down that starting place again. Yeah, absolutely, any footballer wants to play every game, every minute of every game. Um, yeah, that's all it is, and I'm doing my best to do so. Let's talk about that that goal then. Uh, you ran away in celebration. Will ran away in celebration. What what went on there? Yeah, so it, it come off Will, and then it did come off me at the end. Um, I think the video clearly shows it. So <laughs> yeah, that's all it was. A bit, of, a bit of confusion, but listen, as as long as it goes in the back of the net, then everyone's happy. Yeah, are you trying to trying to get that switched over then? I guess. <laughs> well, the video the video is evidence that it should be switched over. So. I don't need to speak too much.